Ethiopian um, culture among its members. Uh, some have asked us to give a, um, a federation, Ethiopian World Federation status report for our involvement, what we're doing and what's up because many of the subscribers to the Ethiopian World Net as well as um, uh, Lion of Judah Society, Brethren and Disciples and 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 others have access, you know, as they've become more informed about the Federation by our proclamation and our um, our dissemination of the ancient Ethiopian culture and our maintaining of the integrity of our divine heritage. Many have um, asked us, well, what, what's going on with the Federation right now? You know, what's happening with the Federation? And even have asked us concerning locals and wanting to form locals and to basically get active and to get interactive into the real work of the King of Kings and His Christ, particularly as it concerns the Ethiopian World Federation. Therefore, I think it's important for us to give a, a status report you know, as, as the state of the, you know, the state of the Federation, so to speak, as of the present time, um, 2011, and this is uh, July, the month of July, when there's usually supposed to be an official, official convention. Now, there are convention activities, quote unquote, and this is not to disparage them, but just to point that out. There are different groups that are disputing uh, for um, executive uh, council or, or board of directors or headquarters status in the Ethiopian World Federation. Um, neither these nor those do we ascribe to or subscribe to due to um, the, the history of the organization, both in recent times up until, up until the present time. Now, one thing we want to stress is locals' rights, EWF local rights. And we're going to go into more articulation of what we mean by EWF local rights. I mean, th this is very, very important when we, when we get a, 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 a good knowledge you understand, the working knowledge, we get the, the, the proper information, we, we trust but verify what we're receiving here and there. We can only build on the base. And, and since there's a dispute about the legalities um, of, of these and those, and there's, there's two main groups, some say three, which are disputing amongst themselves in, in court concerning... Um, who's the head of the federation and who's the proper headquarters and taking each other to court, you understand, almost year to year. And they've even entangled us in that whole process between the years of 03, 2003 to um, the new millennium in 2007. Um, this was a very um, informative uh, period that we went through, and we're about to disclose some documentations concerning that, especially for our membership. So for those who really want to know, well, well, our testimony and, and what evidence do we have so that they can be better informed, at least have our witness of why we have come to the present decisions to um, stand down from our uh, power of attorney status and, and, the, and, and the legal um, status that we, based on the best of information, know that is right and exact with the true foundation and true history and true timeline of the Ethiopian World Federation. But in recognizing the preamble and the divine heritage and, and Article 1, which speaks about the, 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 the dissemination of the ancient Ethiopian um, culture among its members, these are the real prerequisites. This is where the real spirit of the Federation is built upon. We must build upon the base and, and, and not the penthouse or the roof. Many are trying to build what we consider to be the penthouse, the roof, the top, and declare we're headquarters, we're headquarters, and be back and forth in, 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 in non, in, uh, under, indecisive and, and cases that the courts, the Babylonian and American courts, that ones and ones are disputing amongst these two major parties. And we can c clearly see a timeline going back to their involvement 
where there's been this ongoing dispute which has served for the most part to divide and, and, and conquer us, you understand, by this uh, um, enemy within and this ignorance and, and this, this almost a tribalism to certain groups, you understand, or certain individuals that, that want to align themselves to irregardless of what their particular argument um, may be. So we're building on the knowledge, the, the information, and, 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 and good faith with whom we have received our charge from and, and, and their, their authorization to be members, first of all, in this organization. We've touched on this, Dr. Glass, on Robinson and the, and the history going back to the 60s, so forth, and, 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 and so on. But we must build on the foundation and, and not build uh, on the capstone or the cornerstone. So we have to build the base, and, and the base is our divine heritage, and, and, and the base is disseminating the, the ancient Ethiopian culture among the members.